Since there's no room for a workbench in my garage, I often rely on my workhorse to clamp down materials with. I only wish that I had more clamps and different size clamps. And now, thanks to the latest shipment from the Home Depot Seeds program, we're gonna be looking at the Husky six-piece trigger clamp set with lifetime warranty, reinforced body, heat-treated steel bar, and removable jaw pads. Here we see the six clamps that come in the box. The large ones are about 11 and a half inches long, tip to tip, while the short ones are eight inches. There are two ways of using the clamps. With this trigger, you just pull and the clamp comes together, but there is a knob that you can loosen, and this allows you to remove this part of the clamp and attach it on the back end. And what that gives you is the ability to use this as a spreader so that if you need to take something apart or stretch it out, you can use the clamp to do that. The throat depth, the distance from the top of the pad down to the bar is an inch and a half for the small one and two and a half inches for the big one. Maximum width between the jaws is six inches on the large clamp and just a little over four and a half with the small clamp. Even on the small unit, the jaw pads are removable. Material build is a metal bar with a nylon plastic fiberglass handle and attachment points. My older work clamp is fairly easy to use. You squeeze the trigger, it slides forward. If you need to come back, you just push the top lever and it slides back and it's fairly smooth. With the Husky, even though the bar is oiled, it's kind of squeaky and very short motion on it when it moves forward. Then if you want to go backwards and release, there's this little red trigger and you pull on that and it's, as you can see, it's still very stiff and just tends to bind. And the issue is no better with the smaller one. I'm sure you can hear that. Again, we pull on the little red lever and it should slide out, but fairly stiff. And maybe a little bit more oil would help, but maybe not. And again, very short movements with pulling the trigger. Here's another clamp configured as a spreader. You'll notice that the Husky label is white on one side and just kind of not painted on the other. Again, squeeze the trigger, it starts to spread out. Although a bit noisy and again, the strokes are fairly short. Then if you want to disengage, it binds a little bit. So it's, it's the same whether the tool is short or long and whether it's heavily oiled or not. Unlike some other clamps that can be adjusted and released from one side or the other, the Husky clamps have a fixed point with an adjustable trigger and that's it. A disadvantage of this clamp is that if you want to make it into a spreader, there's no way to reverse this without taking apart the ends, and they're not made to do that. On some units, you can actually drill out the stops and make it into a reverse. While with the Husky, converting into a spreader involves removing the red screw on one end. Then you take that part of the clamp off, take it to the opposite side, reverse the orientation, attach it, and then reinsert the little knob. Once that's done, you can use it as a spreader. Clamps can come in really handy when you need another hand to hold something in place, and these are no exception. About the only concerns I have are 
one that one side of it is fixed so it can't slide forward though I like the fact that you can just detach it from here put it on this and then it becomes a spreader and the other issue I have is the handle just feels really small in my hand and of course that's an even bigger issue when you go to the smaller unit but that aside it seems to work pretty well I'm not afraid of the nylon plastic material as this is plastic and this has lasted many years I've never had any of my plastic component clamps break on me um, and I tend to abuse them a bit so overall I think it's a really good tool and worth considering and of course should the nylon or fiberglass material fail for any reason just take it back because it does come with a lifetime warranty if you found this video interesting or useful, give us a thumbs up, leave us a comment, join the subscription team, and as always, thank you ever so much for watching.